Hello everyone, today we would know how to get into BIOS for HP MB laptop. <clears throat> to customize the boot option, to change the date and time, also the configuration, how the computer would behave, we need to get into BIOS for many reasons, so let's show you how to do that. Okay, so example for this one, I would like to change the windows. I want to upgrade it so I just connect my USB which is contained with Windows 10 yeah so once I power it on immediately we have to click on F9 to get into device so power on F9 asking okay so when you press F9 it will take you to the boot manager from there also you can get into BIOS so you can see press F10 to set up BIOS so I click in it straight away one BIOS now so we're gonna directly go to security when security is clear we need to go to system configuration from there if you go down you can go to boot option enter here then you need to get into legacy support which is disabled as you can see we need to turn it on click enter and then go to enable once you go to the legacy option they're going to ask you for confirmation say yes enter and now automatically as you can see the security secure boot would be disabled once you turn on the legacy support if it doesn't you must need to make it disabled due to change the boot option okay now I'm gonna uh, UEFI boot order and legacy boot order both of them I'm gonna select USB hard disk by pressing F6 okay then the legacy also i'm gonna change it to usb hard disk because i want to turn it on from this usb thumb drive press f6 okay so in the both option as you can see usb hard drive is on the top list so now if i save these changes then the machine will turn it on from this usb okay so i'm gonna press f10 and enter yes it may ask for the code Gonna be restart. Yeah. Now asking for the confirmation because we are changing the boot option. So at this point, for my machine, four two eight one. So I'm gonna click four two eight one, and I'm gonna hit the enter. Once I hit the enter, it will take directly from the USB let's check okay at this point it didn't it gone back to the old system let's turn it off again it's completely off now if I turn it on and press like before F9 now it's going to give me option to turn it on from the USB it's going to come up yes as you can see now this is available before it was on because the boot option was only in EVFI now if I hit enter from the USB straight away it will turn on from this USB So that's all for today for this machine if you want to get into BIOS check my video and there are also more videos available for the BIOS help and support if you have any problem please leave a comment and if you if my video helped you please subscribe my channel thank you so much bye for now